places. Two touches, one touch, uh, head up, perfect pass. Man, you love this guy. You love what Messi's doing. Good one to you. Okay, we all know what Lionel Messi has been doing over at Inter Miami. We've not had an opportunity to react to it yet. I've talked about it before in a video, but we've not had an opportunity to properly react to it yet. So that's what we're doing in this video, looking at the un unbelievable moments and the many times, especially over this summer, that Lionel Messi has been able to shock the world. So without wasting any more time, guys, let's get straight into it. And once again, the, the main thing with this Inter Miami team is that, oh my God, Oh my god, straight away. What a finish. What was I was saying, like a, a, a team that, we, we know the story of Inter Miami by now. A team that was, um, who had the worst record of the MLS last season. Get in a player like Lionel Messi um, and are able to win a cup. And the, like the performances Messi is able to put up for this team. The clutch moments he's been able to give to this team. I think this was his first game, if I'm not mistaken. When he was able to score those two goals. Free kick. Boom. Bro. A winner as well. This guy is something else, bro. This guy is something else. As I said, the, the greatest footballer of all time. I've had my take on, you know, the offensive the offensive debates that they are between him and Messi, him and Ronaldo, sorry. And in my opinion, this is a Ronaldo slander video, it's really, really not close. When we're talking about the best player of all time, a player who's able to facilitate for his teammates the way Messi does, a player who's able to score um, at the rate that Messi does, dribble at the rate Messi does. Look at this. Like, not... Uh, uh, there's, of course, power to, to that goal, but it's just placed perfectly. It's like so far from the goalkeeper, as much as he tried to reach for that one, he was never going to get it. Jordi Alba knows exactly where Messi is. Fantastic pass, fantastic finish. It's that understanding he's able to create as well with, you know, him, himself, Busquets and Jordi Alba. Good thing they're here, man. Touch, bang! Perfect touch. Kills the ball perfectly and is just ready for him to smash it behind the goal. Pause. And again, when he's not scoring or assisting, he's able to facilitate for his teammate, teammates at an extremely high level. That's a perfect cross. Gets the ball. Two touches. Look at the pinky places. Two touches, one touch, uh, head up, perfect pass. Man, you love this guy. You love what Messi's doing. Good one to you then. It's just goal involvement galore. I've had my take on, you know, people using this, not using assist the right way overusing assist but with Lionel Messi it's not just the fact that he's you know making those those passes to goals as they call it it's the fact that he's actually creating these chances for his teammates like an assist like this is half a goal an assist like this is half a goal and this is these are most of Messi's assists bro look at that perfect control sets Busquets up perfectly Give him a sense of scissors, funny. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> but yeah, man. <laughs> Bro, what is this own goal? But it, again, he's putting these balls in extremely dangerous areas. Extremely dangerous areas. They're very hard to defend. That's why he went on to score, uh, you know, an own goal. He definitely gets some blame for it. But because the ball was in an, an, an area between, you know, uh, the 
the small box and the and the goalkeeper touch even touching the ball in that area is extremely dangerous that's what, that's what they called dangerous areas but anyways guys uh thank you very much for watching the video until the end you much appreciate it please leave a like comment subscribe share do all those things to please help me grow this channel and i'll see you guys soon